Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to replace a sky in DaVinci Resolve. Let's get started. So, I've placed my clip on the timeline. This technique works best if there's a strong contrast between the sky and the rest of the scene. Now let's head over to the color page. First, I'll go to the node editor, right click on node 1, hover over add node, and select add serial to create a new node. Next in the qualifier section, select the 3D qualifier. Then choose the Pick Add tool to begin selecting the sky area. Now draw a line across the sky, making sure to cover as much of it as possible. The Picker Add tool allows you to draw multiple lines to refine your selection. Next, go to the Effects panel and search for Sky Replacement. Once you find it, click and drag it directly onto the node graph. Make sure the Sky Replacement effect is properly connected to the node graph. Then connect the blue output alpha of node 2 to the blue input of the sky replacement node. Now let's refine the edges. Select node 2, then increase the pre filter value all the way to 100. Do the same for the post filter. This will smooth out the edges of the selection. Next, select the sky replacement node. In the settings, enable the artificial sky option. Then increase the opacity to 1. You should now see a default blue sky applied to your scene. I'm going for more of a sunset vibe here, just for fun, let's give the sky a warm, golden tone. Click on the sky color option and browse through the available colors to see what looks best. I'm going to set it to a very pale yellowish cream to match the sunset vibe. Now for the horizon color, I'm choosing a soft peachy orange. It adds a gentle sunset glow to the horizon and blends nicely with the sky color we picked earlier. You can also tweak the softness parameter to blend the new sky more naturally with your footage. Now let's add some clouds to make it more realistic. Go to the Artificial Clouds option and enable it. Then increase the cloud opacity all the way up to 1. You'll now see some white clouds appear in the sky. Let's customize them a bit. Click on the Cloud Color option and choose a shade that blends nicely with your sunset vibe. Something warm and subtle usually works best. You'll find lots of settings to play with under the Cloud options, like Scale, Shape, and many more. Just experiment with them and adjust everything until it matches the mood and look of your clip perfectly. If you look further down, there's also an option for artificial sun. Try enabling it to see if it enhances your scene. Depending on your clip, it can add a nice touch of realism and warmth. And finally, I'm going to slightly lower the gain value to give the overall image a more balanced and cinematic look. And that's it. If you found this helpful, give it a like, subscribe for more, and don't forget to tap the bell.